The ghost town of Bannock was once a booming gold rush camp, the first capital of the Montana Territory and said to be one of the most violent and lawless places in the West. And now Bannock State Park is known as one of the best preserved ghost towns in the country. And it takes a lot of effort to keep these old buildings stabilized. The legislature in, in uh, 2007 recognized the need to keep these buildings stabilized. The Mead Hotel is actually a core building to Bannock. The northwest corner started the slump. It puts a lot of stress on the building. Plaster has continually fallen off, and so we saw a need that this building had to be stabilized, bring that, that northwest corner back up uh, level. That was done using these helical piers. In order for the construction company to install the helical piers, they needed to disturb the ground immediately adjacent to the mead. The soil next to the mead contains all sorts of artifacts that help give us the history. The buildings are one part of the historic record, but what's in the ground left behind by the residents of Bannock is a whole other part of the story, and that's what archaeology can tell you. For the people who live and work around Bannock, this really isn't a ghost town, but more a living classroom with a window, or maybe a lot of windows, into Montana's rich and colorful history. This is Mike Gurnett, out among Montana's Fish, Wildlife, and Parks.